Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna be featuring the new Merit uh, eyeshadow in the color A uh, Studio. I finally got this in the mail. Um, I ended up purchasing the eye set I have been raving about on my Instagram uh, stories. It comes with the brush. You get to pick one eyeshadow of your choice. You get a full-size mascara and a full-size brow product in the color of your choice. Um, and I think it's the best uh, value for that set. I believe it's like... $83 if I'm not mistaken and I also picked up a shade slick uh, color in Falcon and this is like a deep chocolate brown and I've been dying to pick this up this fall so let's go ahead and get started I'm gonna prep my face with the Merit Great Skin Glow. I'm gonna use one pump of this all over my face. Now, I wish that they like get a better pump for this. I love this stuff and it does wonders for balancing my skin, doesn't break me out. It's almost like a one and done for me uh, because it provides me with enough moisture where I don't need to go in with moisturizer. Like, this is more than enough. Oh, and it feels like a drink of water on my skin. I kind of just like press it in. I bring down whatever's left over down my neck. If you guys are wondering, like, Isabel, why are you talking so low? My child is sleeping, okay? This is the time I get to film and do chores that I don't, that I can't do, you know, while watching a toddler. I kind of just rub whatever's left on the back of my hands. This dries fairly quickly it does not leave your skin oily or greasy it is such a good product and i only need one pump so those of you with combination oily skin one pump is more than enough those of you with normal uh to dry skin two to three pumps just depending on the dryness of your skin i love this stuff all right I'm gonna go in with my complexion stick in the shade linen and we're just going to do a couple of swipes on my face, forehead, nose, eyes. I hope you all are having a lovely weekend. <laughs> Um, our weekend has been eventful, not in the most positive way, but here we are. I'm using my um, number one brush to just blend that all in. The glow serum that I start off with is actually works obviously. It's all part of the same brand. So I'm sure it was formulated to really work well with all the products in the line. But I find that this serum just makes this foundation glide onto the skin in the most seamless way as it should right <laughs> but it it really does like i could see a major difference in the amount of time i spend blending when i use a serum versus when i don't Next, I'm going to go in with some bronzer. This is in the shade Clay. I just realized I didn't swatch any of this stuff for you. Let me swatch linen so you guys can kind of see. So the reason I usually like to swatch products that I talk about is because I'm getting a lot of new people um, on my channel and this is important i get a lot of comments about swatching so this is in the shade clay the bronzer stick is 
goof proof so if you're not somebody who is good at doing makeup this is the bronzer stick for you and i kind of just do this whole situation now the bronzer stick has more of a creamier natural finish my skin soaks it up really well i'm using a real techniques buffing brush my skin soaks it up really well it doesn't like stay greasy or anything um like that but if you want to set it you can set it i love this the like the tone of this bronzer it is not too cool not too warm blends out super easy i feel like sometimes bronzers can look really orangey if that makes sense i don't know why there's something about my the undertone of my skin where a lot of bronzers tend to look orange on me anybody else or is that just a me problem but anywho you can blend this out with your fingers you don't need to use a brush um i just like to use a brush because i am a brush gal through and through through and through they have a collaboration that's coming out soon they are actually making their bags their corduroy uh, signature makeup bags in leather i'm assuming it's going to be some kind of sustainable like not real leather uh, because you know they're all about sustainability and stuff like that next i'm going to go in with blush this one is in the shade fox and it is a really beautiful neutral brown terracotta color which i find to be perfect for the fall and i think it is going to agree with most skin tones so this I do prefer to set on days where my skin is like extra oily um, because this does have a dewier uh, finish. However, I'm not going to set it today because it's cold for the first time. It is 67 degrees and we, for Floridians, that's cold. Um, I know you people living up north are laughing right now. Um, but for us, anything below 70, we're pulling out our winter gear. So judge us all you want. It is what it is. So I'm just blending that in with an It Cosmetics foundation brush. And I like a very subtle blush. But you can pound this on and build it up as dark as you want. Been there, done that. So... I just like that they blend seamlessly and without any issues. I'm going in with my highlighting stick in Bounce. This is kind of like a very cool toned, subtle, rosy champagne. And you can see how subtle that is. Again, this is, I think, the most emollient product in their line. And a little bit goes a long way for me just because like i said i'm not gonna set this look because the rest of my face is feeling like just right today because of the weather um so if i apply very very little of this my skin will soak it up nicely and i don't have to worry about my hair sticking to my face so as you can see it's just a very subtle highlight truly truly a nice product let's get to eyes so i picked up another number two brush because i wanted to have more than one uh, especially because if i want to layer products you know i don't want to have to always rely on having some kind of wipe next to me to wipe the brush and use another color so i felt like having two of these was gonna be best for 
my particular lifestyle so you have a dome ended brush on one end and a little liner brush at the other end you can use this to do eyeliner with their deeper shades you can also use this to like smudge on the lower lash line whatever you choose to do is up to you so here we have the beautiful packaging i mean do we not think that they knocked it out of the park with this i think they did um i love that it clicks shut and open here is the color and of course i am gonna swatch this for you guys so here is a finger swatch this is my corresponding actually let me do a little bit more this is my corresponding shade of, um, that they have on their site according to the foundation shade that i use so if you look at the foundation shade that you have if you go on their site they will tell you according to your foundation which shade is your neutral natural everyday shade all right, I'm gonna swatch this. This has a soft matte finish for those of you who don't know. These do not budge and I don't have to use primer uh, before using them. So here is a nice healthy swatch of that color. These are heavily pigmented and I'm gonna tell you right now, you are probably, I mean, I double cleanse no matter what when I wash my face. But if you don't double cleanse, you are going to need either a little bit of micellar water or a little bit of um, makeup remover because these, these are the real deal. They blend out super easily. And for those of you who are new here, I have tried these as like a base and applied like other shimmer products on top like creamy shimmer products on top and they work great with other products so if you want to layer it that is an option um now have i the only way i haven't tried these is i haven't layered more than one of these on top of each other obviously these were not designed <laughs> to be like layered literally they are solo shadows so they are strictly designed to be used as like a one and done shade and due to the nature of their finish like they are creamy upon application but they set down as a soft matte that doesn't sink into fine lines or anything like that um so you should be fine even if you have like wrinkly eyelids this is gonna hold up just fine anyways back to what i was saying so I haven't tried it but i don't think these if i got like this and like another shade and tried to layer them on top of each other i don't think it would work that well just because of the matte finish um so there is that all right so here is that shade on the eyes definitely it is my neutral shade um now let's go ahead and apply some brow gel i have my brow gel in the color neutral this is like their clear version next let's apply some mascara this is a mini i've been using that came in a set oh i think it was a holiday set i can't remember but i've been using these i love I love their mascara. I just purchased a brand new full size bottle. But these, this mascara, like, is my holy grail. It gets better as it ages and it lasts forever in the tube. I mean, just when I think this is going to be dry and crusty and I can't wear it anymore. Nope. It, I would say it is a workhorse of a mascara. My child is awake. I'm not sure if you can hear her in the background because her room is literally right next to this room. And because this is 
the only room in the house that gets the best amount of lighting. That's why we're here. Okay, now let's try on a falcon. Is this not the most beautiful fall shade? This is their Shade Slicks. And let's go ahead and swatch this for you guys. I mean, it is kind of like, it's a lip oil. And you can build it up. Like, look how stunning that is. So, let's apply that to the lips. I'm going to show you what this looks like alone. And then layered with 1990. Here is the Shade Slick Alone. And now let me show you how this looks like with the lipstick in 1990, which I think it's like it's partner shade. I'm going to swatch it literally right next to it. Here is 1990. So if you're looking for like a lipstick and a gloss, this is where it's at for you. All right, so here we have 1990, the lipstick. And then if we layer Falcon over it for a glossy. Look, there you go. Is this not the most gorgeous fall look with like a statement lip? I will leave my affiliate link down below so that you guys can shop through my merit link for any of these products. If you have any questions down below, I will try my best to answer them. Thank you so much, you guys, and have a lovely weekend. Bye.